Hello, my name is Les Litwin. I'm the Technical Sales Director of Antrica. The Jupiter Diamond is currently in use in battlefields around the world, mounted in tanks and other military vehicles. It's protecting the occupants of these vehicles using four to eight cameras, giving them full 360 degree situational awareness, and also with artificial intelligence to detect and identify what those threats are protecting the vehicle occupants from any threat on the ground or in the air, especially in urban warfare. So let's see this product in action. So here you can see a typical urban warfare scenario, armored vehicles patrolling, occupants inside using a touchscreen display, they can see all around the vehicle. They can actually use artificial intelligence to help them detect a soldier and in other scenarios, they can also use the AI to detect airborne vehicles in this particular example. Now we're looking at a thermal camera detecting a tank. So eight cameras, artificial intelligence, and a touchscreen display inside the cab. So as AFVs are used more and more in urban combat, they are much more at risk from IEDs, from suicide bombers, from all sorts of things, which is why having 360 degree visibility inside the cab is so important. So situational awareness can be used in infantry fighting vehicles, armored personnel carriers, engineering vehicles, and even the main battle tanks. So the threats to AFVs in an urban environment are different to those in an open field scenario. So the features of Jupiter Diamond are it's a multi-camera system with touchscreen display. There's threat assessment built into it and continuous uncompressed video recording such that this can be used later to improve the AI model. You've also got powerful edge AI which identifies threats real time on the monitor in front of the occupants of the vehicle and also gives them powerful alert. And finally, there's ease of use. It's a very simple and intuitive interface with touchscreen display. Okay, so here you can see the touchscreen display along with different layout formats, which we'll show you. Also below that, you have five IP cameras and these are streaming to the box, which is then decoding these IP cameras and displaying them. At the same time, it's recording raw video, which can be used for AI training at a later date. So here you can see the physical uh, unit in place. This is an actual photograph of the complete unit with the menu down the left and all the displays in the middle. This is all touchscreen. And as you can see at the back, there is a slightly larger box which contains all the encode decode electronics. And finally, a short video of the device in action. Here you can see one of our test engineers is just videoing this for us. And you can just see the green outlines of the AI picking him up as a human. Obviously, the AI can be used for other functions, but the displays can be changed in various different ways. So hopefully that gives you a good idea of what the product looks like. 